Uh, if we look at the federal level uh, at this time, we see that most of our national problems are not being well managed. Uh, we're in trouble across a wide front in terms of crime, riots, uh, the stalemate in Vietnam, the rising cost of living, higher taxes, government bureaucracy, and we need some fresh leadership. We need some men that are willing to tackle these problems uh, from some new vantage points and uh, begin to bring some common sense back into government. Uh, the people today, I think, are being taxed to death, and they're tired of seeing their money wasted. And that's been the story of the last four years, and I think you're going to see a substantial turnaround. So I would say the number one issue in this campaign is the desperate need for new leadership, and that means new Republican leadership. Mayor Johnson, what are the, the main outlines of, of the job fair? We are uh, trying to initiate a two-phase program. We're asking employers to pledge several thousand summer jobs, really about 3,500 minimum, for boys and girls from low-income families. Uh, these are families in about uh, the $3,300 a year bracket uh, in that general neighborhood. But uh, at the same time, we're asking people to contract uh, for and employ people who uh, don't have the usual job requirements fully met, uh, but who want to work and uh, with a little help, uh, sort of a hand up, you might say, can uh, get into the useful part of the circuit that will make a contribution to our society instead of uh, leaving them as uh, people who must take something out to survive. What are they doing in there? Well, they're talking about how to set up a political campaign headquarters that looks right for the neighborhood. How to use volunteers and keep them busy and happy, even though you may not need them. And how to make a Democrat vote for a Republican candidate without feeling guilty. About 200 Republicans, candidates and party executives alike from around Texas, are attending, hearing from congressmen and experts on the nuts and bolts of political campaigning. Most prominent among those present from the state, of course, was state GOP chairman Peter O'Donnell. The man running this seminar and others like it around the country is Ray Humphreys, the director of training and education for the National Republican Committee. There's no question about it. Politics and campaigning is underway in Texas. At the University of Dallas, this is Travis Lynn, WFAA News. Sigma Chi Derby Day began in 1930 on the campus of UCLA, and it spread like crazy. There's really no reason for it except to have fun. Who can blame them for that?
Derby Day will end this evening with an all-school dance. Mike Lee, Channel 8 News, SMU. great influence on politics that we do today and we need to understand how to use that. 